Hey guys, Jafai here. This video will cover the loot, scientists, lock crates and additional features for the cargo ship. Let's have a look at the loot crate spawns with 27 possible basic, military or elite crate spawns. The spawns for these crates include being within the ship's tower, the top deck and downstairs below the deck. This is the loot I have received after one run of looting the crates. The loot you can get will vary depending on if the crates have been looted and the spawn chances of each item. The cargo ship contains around 12 blue scientists armed with shotguns, SMGs and assault rifles. The scientists require more shots to kill compared to players and can sometimes have a dead on aim. It is recommended to come to the cargo ship with medical supplies, guns and some friends. The scientists when killed can drop tools, medical supplies, keys, scrap, weapons, attachments, clothing and components. Due to the scientists and the nature of the cargo ship it makes it very unlikely you will find lower tier players running around, so be vigilant at all times since you'll only be encountering higher tier players. I would suggest using at least a hazmat suit or for further protection a road sign and a hoodie as armour to defend against the scientists and other players. Three lock crates will spawn on the cargo ship during its time circling the island. Each crate will spawn after each other. The cargo ship will sound its horn three times when a lock crate has spawned and can be heard across the island. Each horn event will also spawn additional military and elite crates, giving early arrivals the chance to loot the cargo ship multiple times. The three lock crates can spawn in different locations on the cargo ship so it might take time to search for each locked crate as they can spawn in the captain's tower, on the top deck or below deck. When a locked crate has been activated, it will take 15 minutes to successfully hack it, allowing you to open it up and acquire its loot. Once open, you have the chance to find explosives, components, attachments, weapons, ammo, armour and a supply signal. The cargo ship can be found by opening the map and locating the ship circling the island. Each lock crate can be seen from the map if they have already spawned and will disappear when they have been looted. There is two ways to board the ship which is through a boat or a helicopter. When in a boat, drive up close to the ship and hug the wall until you reach the ladders. Make sure to save most of your fuel since you'll be ditching your boat. Turn your head to the left and look at the ladder and press E to climb. Be careful as scientists and players could be guarding the ladders. Additionally, skilled pilots can also drop off their friends in strategic positions on the cargo ship, surprising enemies, possibly giving you the height advantage and skipping the dangerous ladder climbing, which they could have been guarding. The cargo ship contains a critical level of radiation when it's ready to depart. This happens after 40 minutes from spawning, requiring all players who are on board to jump off before they are killed. Before the radiation is released, you will hear a siren giving you time to race off the ship. No level of radiation equipment can protect you against the cargo ship's final departure. Once the cargo ship has departed, it will take 2 to 4 in game days, which equates to 1 to 2 hours for a new ship to spawn, giving you time to gather guns, meds, and a boat in hopes for a successful takeover. When you are ready to depart, head to the back of the ship where the rib boat will spawn. It will spawn with 50 low grade fuel, but make sure to bring more as your base might be further away. Once the low grade is ready, release the boat from the ship. Now, quickly drive off before pirates come to steal your loot. Another useful tip is if you are a solo or want a better chance at saving your loot, you could always bring a scuba suit and a diving tank with you. This will allow you to dive off the edge of the ship and swim away without being chased by enemy players. The cargo ship is a dangerous and late stage event which will require patience, accuracy and planning to successfully acquire its lock crates. With a group of friends and enough meds, the ship can be easily taken over from the scientists. However, the enemy players will be the primary threat, so guard all ladders and listen out for approaching boats. Thanks guys for watching and I hope to see you in the next video.